This guy's about to put a 5,000 watt generator on his back, apparently, and troop up this hill that I'm standing on here. This is a slippery, like, rock face. It's ridiculous. I can't even stand on. I have, like, these toe shoes. This guy's crazy. This is the shit. This is the jungle shit, people. This is it. In real life, these people are animals. Beasts. I have to put this away, I feel so bad, I gotta help. These dudes are busting the ass, I've never seen anything like it. Working hard on this. Crazy. They're just gonna do one layer at a time and just kind of slide it across. bunch of spikes down there and trying to avoid them because everybody literally they have these shoes on and you can't you can't walk around here with shoes like you need bare feet to grip the ground otherwise you slide everywhere so we made it we are here at the owner's house, this big new house. It's kind of like a bar. We're just kind of hanging out right now, um, getting to know the place. It's beautiful here. There's a long pathway, goes into the jungle. There's a little school down there. There's some, a lot of people that say there's about 100 people here, more young, because they've had a lot of children recently, which, uh, you know, is gonna, that's why, why it's a lot more important that we're here to help them with money and things like that. Uh, growing an economy and food and it's gonna be amazing. Um, I think that there's gonna be an amazing peace between us all here and feel really good about it. Really good about it. Setting up our room at night and uh, we come across this thing right here. Huge. I've never seen a spider actually quite big. I've seen one. Is it alive? Oh, yeah. It's alive. It's alive. <laughs> and it's alert. You gotta make sure you're, like, you should zip your bag out and shit, bro. Yeah, it's fucking nuts, dude. Yeah. <clears throat> Alright, so we're gonna go to the jungle. Oh, shit. Welcome to the jungle. Oh, we're not fun games. <laughs> it's just a bunch of sweat just like roll off of it. Oh god. So, so that's where the spider is. This is where my bed is. Feel free, but you gotta kill it. I want to. It's just there's this something that. What is behind it? The thing is, is if you puncture that egg, there's gonna be little babies yeah, spill out that's everywhere. Hard to set, but I want to fucking stab it, but it fucking it's got all those babies. On. Which is even worse, because that means it's going to hatch all those babies in this fucking place. Jungle problems. If we can get that, um, if we can get that Jungle tr- problems. <laughs> Third world problems. Holy shit. We are out, officially. This is getting out of line. <laughs> Been up for a few hours working hard. Uh, we have managed to get uh, some things set up. We're still setting up things as we speak. I have a solar panel right there charging. Um, we killed a chicken last night and ate it. Uh, here's the inside. There is, um, where we're cooking food right now. And a little sink that we got. Uh, some food. And, um, so this is the downstairs of the house. We have the table. 
I'll go around and show you guys. Um, we just made a broom. There's our broom. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, buddy. <laughs> and, uh, pliers? Uh, I, don't, I don't think so, no. Uh, so we have a badass generator. Here's our table, our food, plates. Um, we're doing a lot of plumbing right now. So some plumbing materials. We have... Yeah. The solar, what? The solar's getting light. Is it yeah, it's charging right now. And here's our propane. We had, we bought a stove. Here's our chickens. They're not doing too well. <laughs> they're pretty, uh, they're beat. It's been a long ride for them. They've been through hell and back. So we got some glassware and pots. Here is our uh, jungle style stove. Boiling water. And a sink that we have not yet set up yet. We are in the process of doing that now. As you can see, uh, they are setting up pipes. So we've bought a bunch of pipes. Um, they're working on this now. We bought a water tank that we are temporarily putting up here um, for gravity reasons. So we can flush our toilet there's a little outhouse we're gonna have our generator here this is our water pump that is connecting to there and it follows it down to the river all the way down we'll start pumping water here's our main three inch hose with a filter that's what that's where we'll be getting um, our water from down there in the Amazon River. Just pumping it up, filling up this, and then it'll come out the bottom, you can see there, and provide us water to the sinks, to the spigot over there, to the toilet, and to wash ourselves. We're gonna install a little makeshift shower for the time being, and uh, we're rocking and rolling. So a quick little update thus far. This is the first morning that we woke up on the property itself next door to the villagers. And man, let me tell you, I am covered in bug bites. I don't know if you guys can you see this. Back. Yeah, my legs are just uh, covered. <laughs> covered, covered, covered. But that's how we do it out here in the jungle you get used to it you're gonna come out and hang out with us I'm telling you this place is beautiful I'll show you the backyard in a few minutes let's go check on Steve and see what he's working on I believe he's building a little staircase I'm trying to I need a machete to cut some roots yeah it looks uh Pretty shitty. Yeah. You're better off fucking probably cutting down some thin logs and laying them across yeah. to give you like just grip on a step. Yep. Looks like he's gonna notch out some steps and we will stick in. There's some wood right here too you could probably just throw in. Just some. Yeah, so this is the front view from the water. A little rickety, obviously needs some work, uh, but that's why we're here. All right, guys, I just wanted to show you really quick the difference between when we first got there and what we are at now. I'm just flying through with the drone really quick to show you the open land and the transformation of the building. Looks beautiful now. Stay tuned. We got a lot going on. All right, sweating balls. We just cut through uh, a bunch of trees. In the jungle to make a shower like a military center. and uh <laughs> while we were doing that i got stung in the face we upset a, a bunch of bugs my legs are literally covered and we came across a military grade centipede a tank of a mil to my little friend <laughs> you can check it off your, your body man yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's can, I, can i 
It's I still gotta face me though. <laughs> Damn. Shit. I'm brown, but look at that too. Yeah. yeah. You bring the wops to here? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Ooh. So look at our shower. What's on the leaf? See, this is our shower yeah. now. We started. Here's the baño, the toilet. This is the more fancy bathroom in the jungle. And we st so we did a very fancy bathroom. We've been working hard on it, sweating bullets. We use the palm trees. And if you can see there, there is a military style shower. And the water runs up into that, the pipe right here, goes up into the bucket. And then you see this right here, we just twist that and water starts coming out. So this is what it looks like on water the outside. Tower. Yeah, here's the water tower that feeds it. We have a wash eight pump tree over there. Look, it's all already. That's there where I say. Yeah. Yeah. That's pop water. It's pretty good to make juice or make some smoothie. Yeah. And then here's the inside of the shower. The tree. The tree. The tree. So you stand right here. And uh, the people upstairs can't see you anymore. We put an extra layer on. The jungle people weren't too happy about that because they had to work harder and they don't care about being naked. So, but obviously people come here, they want to feel secure. So that is what we have now. The big shower area, pulls in the ground. It just filters through and washes down the hill. You can see the toilet. Oh yeah, and I'm sweating bullets. I'm covered with dirt and bugs. So I think it's time. I'm gonna take my shower. I love you guys. I'm setting this up beautiful. Look at you. Could even, you can even kind of see a nice view when you take your shower over the top. Unbelievable. Love you guys. Thanks for watching. It's only gonna get better from here. Okay, so it's amazing, guys. What happened was. I used my solar panel to completely charge my phone back to 100% out here in the jungle. So I'm running on 100%. I just took my first shower, which is right here. Uh, you can see the spigot right there. And we have a front side and the back side and a wall you can see the jungle while you're on the there. toilet yeah and you literally just that's the view of, of the jungle as you shower uh it is beautiful and as you could tell i just got out of my first shower here at the asha land and man i feel good rejuvenated a couple big bug bites and some whatnot but it's all part of it i'm pumped uh drew's next i think uh, no, I'm third, oh, sadly. Sounds like they lost. somebody lost a bet. Uh, so it sounds like Steven's next, or yeah. Danny's kind of strutting around over there, too. And, uh, yeah, this is what we get to see, sitting up here at the top level of the big building. Pure beautifulness. We're going to clean up some of this stuff. I'm not sure if you just saw a hawk fly by, um, but one did. Beautiful. We have a couple things to clean up, but man, for day one on the land, some shit done. we are kicking ass and having. And we're born for this. I think we're born for this. Yeah, we were definitely. This shit was fucking amazing, and you need to come hey, enjoy it. We'll see you here. All right. So we took a quick trip walking around the land. Um, Danny was able to find a couple things for us. Um, some yucca, right? Yucca. Yep. Yep. So, this is wild potato. it's a wild potato here. It's on our land. It does in the Amazon area. It yep, it goes everywhere. So, we'll be able to utilize that on the property. And not only that, but we also have some plantains. Yeah. Felled right in the back of the land here. Um, past this little trail back here. There's a bunch of these trees, and this just fell uh, not too long ago, so they're a little green right now, maybe about three days or so. They'll be good to go. And again, that is on the land, so we'll really be able to um, necessitate everything we need from the land for the most part. And we're gonna grow a garden. It's gonna be amazing. You gotta come 
come check it out. Alright, I know you can barely see me right now and it's really dark, but that yuca I showed you a little bit earlier is now fried up on our plates with some uh, rice and yeah, there we go. It's fried up. Oh my god, this is absolutely delicious. It's like having a giant french fry. Ooh. So good. This is amazing. You gotta check it out.